Hey guys and welcome to this week's video. There was only really one topic I wanted to talk about this week and that was kindness and I think a lot of you will understand why. I'm sorry for the darkness, there is a hailstorm that keeps coming and going so the lights keep on going. It's just madness. You know that famous rhyme, we learn it in primary school and I'm sure a lot of you will know it, it's about bullying, it sticks and stones may break my bones but words will never hurt me. And I think while it's a lovely rhyme and a lovely idea, it's kind of a lie because words can hurt and what people say can have a massive effect. I am a big believer in never judging anyone on what they show on the outside world because I hid and continue to hide a lot from the world, from my family, from my therapists. No one knows how bad someone's life really is or how much someone is really struggling because it's not something you really want to put out there in the world. I've never understood and I don't think I ever will understand how people can find tearing other people down fun and entertaining. I just, I don't get it at all. I have had my fair share of bullying and I have been trolled several times online and it absolutely sucks and I don't really think people understand how much their throwaway comment means because all of a sudden those stupid comments that they make about you all of a sudden become your beliefs about yourself and you can't get them out of your head and you're just stuck with them and they just on repeat over and over again. People need to think before they speak because a throwaway comment or a throwaway judgment they make could be the thing that pushes somebody who's barely hanging on over the edge and that's not right. If you don't like something about somebody, fine, but keep it to yourself. Use that famous saying, if you, can't, if you haven't got anything nice to say, don't say nothing at all. Because saying nothing causes no harm, but saying something is causing harm. For example, I know I am not the prettiest person. I am well aware of that. I also know that I am a big girl and I will never be skinny. And I also know that a lot of people don't find me attractive. But what I don't need is people to point that out to me because I'm not stupid. So just be kind for once. See you next week. Bye guys.